Hey friends, welcome to a new video. If you're new here, my name is Stevie and I post videos about weight loss, what I eat in a day, getting over binge eating disorder, and just lifestyle vlogs in general. Today, I finally, I finally broke down. My fridge is an absolute disaster and we waste a lot of food because I just can't see it. So, I bought the bins. You know what I'm talking about, right? The clear bins. I did it. I did it. And you know what? I, I think this is really going to help me see all the fresh food in my, what's it called? Oh, the <laughs> fridge without having to waste any of it. Um, so hopefully, fingers crossed, this helps. Before we get started, if you guys could hit that like button, it helps out my channel so much. And if you would like, please consider subscribing. Anywho, let's go get my fridge back in order or in order for the first time I don't know all right don't judge me I'm trying this is what we're working with we have a lot of the condiments in this drawer there's a cheese drawer vegetables um, random meats everywhere more vegetables more vegetables back there random assortment of things a random assortment of things so we're gonna work on this today and see if we can get it looking better the first thing we need to do is to clear it out fourth of july meat. i didn't even know i had these All lettuce. We get a uh, subscription to a local farm every week, and this is what prompted me. Ew, some of it's gross. To get those organizer things because um, I'm sick of just seeing a million bags in the fridge. some of his homemade pickles. This is a mild one. I think more like a medium. This is what I'm talking about. This isn't even opened. I have to talk quietly or Caitlin might like kill me. Not really, but she won't be happy because I, I have a really bad habit of it. This expired in, I'm afraid, I'm embarrassed. This expired in April. It is July and it's not open. The back of the fridge is where food goes to die. That is for sure. We are cleaned out. We definitely need to clean the shelves though. Like, ew, gross, what happened here? What happened here? So I'm gonna do that real quick. And then, and voila, it's clean. I love how easy it is to clean this uh, fridge, except I couldn't get this guy out. I couldn't get the glass out either, and I don't think it comes out. I bought these on Amazon. I believe they were about $40, and they all come with lids. There's three sizes. And now I just want to arrange how I want it in the fridge before I put food in them. Um, so if I need to move shelves, I can. There is a lot of space the back though I wish they were deeper I'm not a big fan of that because I don't want things to be pushed back so they stack which I really like so I have my protein shakes over on this corner um, I got these from Aldi I'm not a fan of them don't get them. I mean, I guess if you like them, comment down below. They just were my fave. And then I have this kombucha I got from Costco. It's only five calories and 
uh, for carbs. So if you're keto, this is a great option. I personally don't like them. You can find them in the non-refrigerated drink aisle, uh, kind of like where the coconut water and stuff is. Then on the top drawer, I'm gonna put this mystery lettuce. Um, what is this? Is it chard? Is it collard greens? I have no clue. Please comment down below what kind of green leafy things are these. So I'm gonna put them up here. It's worked really great to have that up there. And then I put my deviled eggs in a bag in here. And it's just nice that they're like contained because when they were just in the bag, they kind of got pushed back in the back and I lost them or they would get thrown on top of things. And then the biggest star of this whole drawer system, and this is why I like the, the lids, is because I can stack these, is I've been eating these vegetables a lot more. So we have carrots in here, zucchini, and tomatoes. This was full like three days ago. And we're actually eating them instead of forgetting that they exist in this drawer. Um, because like you have to go into this drawer to like, you have to know what you're looking for to go get it. You don't see it, but this is like, every time I open the fridge, bam, there's vegetables right there. I know that I need to use the zucchini and these carrot chips. I really like eating with lunch with the dip. As you can see, I put my meats in here, but they're all gone because it's not the 4th of July anymore. We ate everything. And then I put the broccoli and the pepper, and I'm gonna put the pepper up front so I can see it because I need to eat it in this one. And then on top of that, I put the sweet sugar snap peas, that's what they're called, sugar snap peas, um, on top of that. So when we open the fridge, like all the fresh food is right there in our face. I could get the egg um, container, like the clear one, but, I just feel like that's a little too bougie for my taste. Like it would look nice, but I don't really need it. Like I know there's eggs right there. I'm gonna put the meats right here. I'm gonna put the butter right there. I have these blueberries. I didn't really have a good container to put them in, but you know, they're right there. It's fine, it works. Greek yogurt. It's gonna go up here, other dairy stuff. Most importantly, the margarita mix. Cannot forget about that. Goes back there. And that's everything. Here is the completed fridge. Like, we need to go get some groceries. I need to get some proteins to go with the vegetables that we have left. We have more vegetables coming tomorrow. My final thoughts on the drawer system, and this is also Caitlin's thoughts, is we should have done it sooner. We both absolutely love being able to see all of our fresh food. It makes it super easy to pull out without making a mess. And uh, it's super important that we push everything back so nothing gets stuck behind anything. If you're interested in these particular bins with the lids, because there's not a lot of bins, especially like nearby in my area that I could find with the lids, I'll link them down below. And uh, I got them from Amazon. I do wanna say I might get a slight tiny commission from them, but just so you know, I bought them because our fridge was a hot mess as you saw in the beginning. I'm not trying to push any product find what works for you. And until next time, friends, be kind to yourself. Bye. I completely forgot about the Lazy Susan. I put all the pickled options that we have in the Lazy Susan because I feel like you know what you're going for in there. And then I pushed it back. I completely forgot about that. And then this is actually what my fridge, I moved to this to get to the pickles. But this is actually what my fridge looks like um, after a holiday, got the, some leftovers. But yeah, it's still really orderly. Okay, bye.